Masach tu ye geoch sa tinil te kat yuhan, atlein gunil chish, kone aya yana chit, ya yidet, ha wuch in sa tig a wu, ya konach oeach tu ye ge, ha shi yidini, ya ye awe, te kakak si sheng git ye awe hoach, ye awe ach tu ti, a jawe te kakoe tati jit. Jin <laughs> A do so a you harm. A dasa dat away to you to tan, ya ye det, a dasa dat. Was our two ye gay a herna? Ye got to dark, ye got to dark routine to cut you harm. Cook. Then a stish. Act to woo ya kay, ya ye could ka a ye. Shak you do a sock. Um, Kutan each da at Ah, wegan. Nask as Adlain as um, and Kag Kagu Chaks Gagange Clegg True Ak Tune de Mook a link it. I think it you katangi shuturtu Saturdays on Zoom. Um Nooch. Okay. Eat kuaha, Aiden? Kuchin, okay. Ah. Uh, I'm glad I looked at the list. I would have waited till the very end there. Um um, I'm sorry, what are we talking about in Klingit? Just... Kilchish Lukachihan Kachain Aya Ayachat Ka Aiden Bowers Um Shangu Kedi Na Khatsati Ka Tlaugani Dach Akhidi Kao Kadli Hit Oe Uh Ak Summer Yuk A um Audigan Oe Ka Kutligus, ka siudakus itkan, ka kataya, here are, here, uh, here we are in the end of that. Um, glad we got some sun this summer and I'm glad we're starting up a new semester. Good to see Okay. Kecha. Gonna see you, Kuch Ain. Ayaye Khatu Asal, Skad U, Kuchna Khatsati, Daklasha Khatsati. Deshitan Dachan Hatsati Kadesin Dach Ayahat Yisakugi Hayuhatangi Nalk Yahati Yidat Achtu de Tuch Diego Gank Achi de Tawaha Siat Skum Yeoe Singet Yuhatangi uh, a dean a dot you to tan a dasa ye da ine a ka a reka 
adrsati would a school woo. A ganesh cheese ache is a ache. A gosh Tehasatin a cuisine eat for a ganesh cheese when a cuisine you had to a salk. Suka Adi Ayahat, Kagwantan Yari, um, uh, Wushki Pan Dutch Han, Ye Hit Dach, um, uh, Deshu Ka Jokut Kwan Dach, um, Yayanaha. Yak e ye quasatini. Um, the cut ye di ye di a ye geneha. Cut would the hues the ka a ak eat yan uaha a ka a ki would the ich would the is. Um, but Aktuusagu, Shinget Yukatangi, Gunesh Chish. Eh, a doctor she talk, it would nehi a key. Um, and oh, the next one's already up. Gunesh Chish, Yaki Yakosakini. A kai de cage, yo cut to a sah. Kunach lingit, a ya has nasteen. Ya de tune it to woo clat woo. A de ka to woo yak e. A plain gunish cheek, ach, shoo ye ne ye. A plain gunish cheek. E e kua ha a cheek woo. Ah, cheesh. Chitwu had to sock. Octla lagoon, you a Kuslana where a Yukatangi Gunaye to what two a Yayidat to a Tlak Yagi Yayukatangi to what two. Yeah, um, Kunakawe, a Octu Sigu, a Ustkanach with two the Adi Yayukatangi. Uh, 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 Nich trek kate de ye wuti a ye yagi da hun la quasitin a a Okay. I I uh, uh bird was a schoon one e tuu sigu swarthmore ge uh bird plate uh Hoot away. 
um <laughs> Dante Kahini Kuake Ya Yagi Yi Awe Is the ting, eh? Ah, Ya Kutan Ach to Wusagu Akach Kadul Sect At Ah. Ach <clears> to <throat> akaat ya andat ik ta. Gunas tish krune. Ash kuchas yat kadidla kuk. Might need help with that. Krune. Kosha ach. Gunas tish. And barbecue fat sick in ka yeast ah. Yuhan kutan dasawe ituasagu isai. Ye had to a sock. Achlingitsae ka a light cock and ach Virginia Oliver, you had to a sock. Ah, um, uh, ach to woozy go away. A schoon wonk, ye, ye gay your satini, ach schoon wonk. Ya ye dat Hana Yk e Hana wa um Kutan uh we Kachanok Han 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 Mainland we uh 
ach uh, uh US Forest Service um Gooch de Gooch Gooch de Kem de Tlet We Tatuk Tatuk Um Uh Yis Shawat Tatuk de Nusk Towson Tauk Katago We Yis Shawat Isak uh do sag do sagi nask tausen katago tauk awe we name her name her ye shall what yik tatuk ah ah tatuk yik shall what tatwasako we ah uh, do sagi to ah goose away, kaduha goose away. We put it back. Ah, ah, ah. Do say ye show it ye katuk. Um, ah. Ya 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 wa dwelling. Ya ya she lives there. Ya yeah well um ah uh kutun kutun bear with me kutun uh what here um uh that's what I did this summer um Having trouble naming her. It'll be put on the map. <laughs> um uh Kanuk. Yay. Uh is working on it. And I wanted to try this one out on you guys. I hear Duffy say it. Um Khataya, you know it's me. Um Skoon, Skoon. Ye jehane, ah, ya yadat, we jin katka nazginach, ah, skun wank awe, ah, go shuk, ah, through nach go shuk, through, um, jin katka nask, ah, jin katka tlake braids. Kunach yuk ewe skun wank. Um, full of life. Um, ach to woosigu we teaching. Ah, tlingitch du chach tu ka teaching them also and making an effort to speak tlinget. It's really hard, but I always speak it after I talk to you guys. Sorry. <laughs> But I'm I'm making the effort gonna for for uh Glacier Bay uh ha to ye yeti tsu ka e shut uh ah the kudzi we shut uh everything was perfection ha to ye yeti tsu ka daislin kwan elders sky de utsu um Anya Lahash sent me a message <laughs> and um everybody that was there Millie Hashke Satuk Ayakeawe um I see Robbie's name on here where is she <laughs> but anyway gonna just look at you Han um uh Tiatan Kadlate Ka Yadi Ayachat Ka um I was looking at this um what's in Nadi Khatsati uh Chaknach Chakna Ayakat um Kirkwan Dachayakat 
um kagwantan katnakadi dachana yakatsa uh hatakanuka um kunakchish a khait yensa ahe a skunwan kewa eh ah ah yana eight i eat kwaha kunash chish wantlain um yana eight you had to a sock um shkun um shkun to sai a east hasai whatever um like kakinach barbara craver you had to a sock um santa kahini yeti um uh Kutan, uh, Hat Heshwasa, <laughs> um, Reese Cha Cha, just a little while ago, um, Seattle, uh, Ach, Achuch, Wutu, Wutu Achuch. We went to Seattle, we flew to Seattle. Ach Yeet, um, Hwasatin, Ka Ach Heek. Uh, Nancy Hwasatin, um, uh, Audi Gan Hwasatin, <laughs> um, Kunach, Kunach Shinkit, Seattle Yeti, uh, Kunach Cars, Kudach, 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 yeah, Ugh. so, um, Achtuasegu Juno, and Santa Kahini, um, Yeti, Yidat. Yake, Yuhan, Hwasatin, Hwasatini. Huch Awe, Yeti Satsin, Yit Kuaha. Gonna cheese you on eight. Gonna cheese you, Satini, the Katuhan. Yay, this is seen you had to a sock plate cock in a Millie Hall. You had to a sock cook a ton show. I a hut. This is seen quan, this is seen quan duck. Um, um, up to a yakana. Um, uh, how you could tongue it in, um, which in. Jigach to me. Um, at Akdushi, um, at Akdushi, how you could tangi Kagach to Hij, Kagach to Hiji, Hiji. Ah, ah, Kusachan Ka. To the on Kasagutin, Yagach to lock, you hun, you go I a quen. Um, cheesh, um, just, um, Yayagi, Yayagi, just play up, play up, play up. After was he boo, Haini, just the cut Yagi, uh, on up. Kujawe, Bilchish, a eight in Zahi. Ah, it a wood saga, eat koha. Gunachish, la cat you han a wood saga, you had to a sack. Um, Slate Kra, Kinak, Elizabeth Will, Aya Ach Sayi Ach Tuusugu Arch. Segan Minneapolis de Yanach Dakin Dakin Ach in Ach who Hande Yan 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 Nagut Nask Takuk Lech Quasatin Ach Kik Ach Kik Ak ik klech kwagi kwagak ya kutan hanalulu de kwadikin klinget hen kenak 
ak ak detan gunachish khune ak it udeshik gunachish ikuaha yish khag Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, Swiss chard, You're on mute. Sorry. Satuk, Satuk, you had to us up. Flingit, um, Flingit, Ena. 
Dek Ben Tan Ayakat, um, Ka Filipino Yeti, Ka Kaguan Tan Dutch Han. Um, I got rattled hmm. when I was on mute. I didn't know. Um, ya, ya Kutan, um, Washington, D.C. Day, uh, Hut, Ka Dachnach Kik, Ka Dachnach Kuni, um, Ku to a teen to National Museum of the American Indian. Hmm. Kalsi Gu Shawat Shan Field Trip. Gunnath Cheesh Hooch. Kecha Wigan Cheesh. Yaku Hana Sidika Yuhan Yake Yih Satini Yahana Um Peter Stanton Aya Achsai Singit Kainach Yah Yuhit Duasak Washtan Khan Ka Glade Ka Ayahat Kichhank Ye Yati Um Tuskunich Ketchikan High School, Kuatlatu Hatsiti, Carol Stanton, you do a sock, Achla, Kuatlatu Wuti, Lauren Stanton, Achish, Lauren Stanton, you do a sock, Achish. Ka kah yu khatungi wuti, um, kichhan ye has wuti, uh, kichhank ye has wuti, uh, yidat Los Angeles ye has wuti, um, kwa, uh, ach tu sigu, um, gunnish cheese hooch away, uh, Shana Kate E. Kuaha Ah Gunnar Cheesh Yacht Shana Kate E. Had to a sock. She at a Kadach kicks Eddie Yeti. I had Kaguantan. Nachatsiti Yakutan We she Achjenei Played Ka Kainach. The devil went down to cluck to the eternal village. Chuck <laughs> on day. The the yan kau chak ande yan akuk katu ku ashi kuyek ka eden gao et yuti Johnny Asatin she e daddy kuk Johnny Asatin. Kichcha Kedain Asiach De Yan Kauch She Kedari Kak Yanashkain Yadak Danak Asa Ian Kasaka the devil went down to Kluk Wan. He was looking for a soul to steal. He was in the bite. He was way behind. He, uh, uh, 
he thought, <clears throat> I'm going to get somebody. He saw Johnny playing a fiddle, playing it hot. He jumped up on a, the devil jumped up on a spruce stump and said, boy, let me tell you what. Uh, we share a yanach, wanganins, yuhan sak. I have more, but I'm saving that for later for you guys. Gunas chish, a kate is a he. Yeah, Ku at lati wu ayahet kaya at nasquini. Sit e tisha nach ye jechene. Gunnel cheese ach e isa hai. Yak e echositini. Cheese, yak e hawe, yak e. Kaskitin. Ilschis Lakat Yuhan, Kaskitina ya Achsai, Glake Cock, Ainach, Jalen Gregory, Hatiwasak, Kanakawa Way Uhan, Yanwasha Ayahat, Kukhetach, Kagontana Hatsati, Deshi Tanya di Ayahat, Duck Dain Tan Ka Ayahia Dutchkan Ayahat Dazante Kahine Hatiti Ik Ewe Yia Awas Daini A little phrase that I found from one of Kane's videos that I really like, I'll share here. Kukde Ke Nas Aha Yukatungi Gilchish. Atlin <laughs> Ho owe yehatu was sa du ani kau denuk. Ka ya ach kak zu kehinok ach yetu was sa. Takshakuk. Ka ya ach kleed knakeshan yehatu was sa. Yeku wujiki ye. Yekina inach ejak yehatu was sa kutsu. Glad Kach Enach Glance Aaron Twitchell at Joe Achish Kanachoe do to us a guo owl teeny Ku Ashkush Cheta Ka Ashkush Kishja Hank Aaron, you do a sock ya achsai Ka Lance Allworth Ye owe kuchet at a tea has a tea Ach tu ye a wuchin has a tea ya Johan Ya ye did call ye dusty at the way that you a quitan. Ya hanak who good a ya cleared get. Ye great claw. Yes, the cut way take way de a art hus, a sunny hus. Has the cache you took with tank ya ye dead. Has the cut has a do sa. Has to kus a honey ah. Has the knock has wo ah one can in Stachit eke have to see. Chan coa 
Ah, good stuff, everybody. That's 50 good minutes and uh, sing it. And you know, we're just getting started. So that that's our whole goal is, you know, starting, there's no class on Monday. That's a pretty good schedule. Because the whole thing, the whole, the proposal for this semester is language speaking, sing it on Mondays, doing lessons on Wednesdays. So we're not going to learn anything on Mondays, except we're just going to use it. It has to be a language of use. But I just I want us to take a look at something here. i got to find this thing. So we have a calendar for our class. And the calendar is online somewhere. OK, here it is. So this is kind of basically <clears throat> what we're going to do. If you see red, don't come. <laughs> we're not getting, we're not getting, we can hang out if there's a small group, whatever. But we also, we have another link for studying. We're going to be exploring some methods of gathering um, in groups. And also we're going to be doing an exchange with uh, the very large group of beginning Tlingit learners, which I think is going to be over 100 this semester. Uh, and we're going to try and get everybody together on the first Wednesday of every month. So that's going to be next week. So next week, all we're going to do is have the big gathering. Uh, but I'll, this link is on our web. 
The link to this particular website is on our web page. Our class web page is clinkitlanguage.com, learning clinkit, advanced clinkit. And uh, my thinking is we're going to all sign up for some spots. So I don't know how to do the math, really. There's, what, 20 of us? So everybody should sign up. We'll start with everybody sign up for one of these dates. And you are going to be a conversation leader with a group of people. It should work out where everybody's taken. Uh, I guess I didn't think all of this through. But basically, so there'd be a group of people, and your job is going to be uh, to give us a prompt, right? So for example, if you're on the team that is, oops, what was that? So if you're on the team for Dizyadijin Kat Kadech Yegi Yakwachiyi, September 12th, so then you would put your name here. So like I would, oops, it doesn't deal with. Google don't know how to deal with underlying combined keystrokes. So like there'd be some names right here. Someone else will put their name in there. Oops, I don't know why this is there. And then our job would be to come up with an idea. For example, uh, my idea might be we're going to look at pictures. Uh, I'm going to think of an animal, and we all got to say stuff about an animal and tell someone else. Until we feel like we run out of stuff, then someone else has to name an animal. Then we talk about that animal. But the goal is to not use any English on Mondays. So what we'll do is like, so the Wednesday, this will be like the super duper class. But normally, as we sort of start to wrap up our class for Wednesday, uh, I'd say, OK, Monday team, what are we going to talk about? What do we need to get ready? And you'll give us some things to get ready, right? So you're going to have to have a plan probably by Wednesday for the following Monday. And then y'all are going to lead us through the conversation. We'll all be here. We'll all take part in this. We'll all do the thing. Uh, but it's going to be your, your job to come up with ideas. And we'll just try this out. And then we'll also have an activity group. So you got to put your name down for at least one of each of these days. We might try two. Well, we'll see what it all starts to look like. And I'll, I'll try and send an email out to the whole, to the great group, as Nora used to say. I don't know why, that was so cute when she said that. The great group. Um, so we can try this out. And we'll do the same thing. So if you look over here, these are basically the things we're going to go over. So uh, I'm going to have to shuffle this around because I forgot about the super classes. But we'll just we'll bump this down. We'll do objects and subjects. We might just do it with everybody. Everybody's going to have to learn a little bit. Even those beginners, throw them right in the deep water. Uh, but let's say, for example, we did thematic prefixes on this date. So this would be the 14th. So that means you would put your, if you put your name here, so I'll put my name here as well. Okay. What that means, and this might be, get a little, I might get myself confused. We'll see how this goes. So that means uh, I will present some sort of activity on the 21st, right? So I don't want, I don't know. I gotta think this thing through. I think that's how we'll do it. Uh, so maybe, maybe no one will put their name on for here, right? So I'll put my name here. So that means I'm gonna talk. I'm gonna present some sort of activity that I think would be neat to help us internalize objects and subjects in verbs, right? I'm like, oh, you know, we should try this thing. And again, there's gonna be a group of people who do this, and you don't have to walk us through the whole thing. You just have to present some sort of idea or activity that help us to internalize some of this stuff. We'll start with that, then we'll move on to the next thing, which on the 21st uh, will be conjugation prefixes. That's kind of the, the, the proposed architecture of this semester. So we're all going to sign up for spots, and then we're all going to do some things as a team. So that means you got y'all going to talk as a group, get some stuff ready to bring it in here, and to blow our minds with your incredible ideas. I have a question. Um, 
last on Monday, you said something about that when we become the leader, um, we'll be trying to use what we learned from the Wednesday class. So we need to be like tied into whatever we kind of learned from the Wednesday class. Yeah, so they're, they're, you're going to sign up for two things. You're going to sign up for a Monday spot and a Wednesday spot. Your plan for your task for the Monday spot is just to keep us talking. Doesn't matter. Doesn't have to be related to what we just learned. But your thing for the Wednesday Wednesday spot will be to give us a, an activity to practice some of the things that we just learned. So just learned means that very day or the Wednesday before. The Wednesday before. Thank that you. we can go over it. We got some time to go over it. And then you're thinking about it. And as a group, you'd be like, you know, and you don't have to give us anything to, you don't have to, if you wanted to share something with us, like maybe the Monday class, we'll spend the whole time in Tlingit, but we'll save five minutes at the end to say anything we need to think about for Wednesday or anything you want to share with us. Uh, but you can always send it to me and I can put it on the website too. There's lots of ways to sort of distribute this stuff. The website is a good tool for us to use for getting things to folks. You don't have to mail anything to anybody or anything like that. So you said there's a group. So should there be more than one name on the sign up list? I think, well, OK, so <laughs> who's good at organizational stuff? Um, what, if, what if you signed up for two spots on each side? They should give us some pretty good numbers, right? How many spots are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, 10, 11, 12, right? So I mean, there should be, we should end up with about four people per thing. Maybe. Click a ten two. Right, so if, let me put the link on in the chat and you all can take a look at that and try it out. And we're, we're almost done too. Uh, oops, where'd it go? Are, are you thinking that um, we would do Monday and Wednesday of the same week or could it be Monday of the third week and Wednesday of the 10th week? Yeah, I would recommend staggering them. Okay. So you don't stress yourself out. Okay. So yeah, I wouldn't recommend doing them both on the same. So even, so also, so like try and get them kind of a little bit further apart. But pick two spots and put your name on there. And we'll, we'll see how it goes. But this might be how we sort of do it in the future. We'll see. And let me know if you got ideas how to do it different. But I'm trying to think of like how to keep it more interactive right just increase the interactivity of it because i think one of my strengths is like figuring out how to create documents and write down stuff and use lots of pictures but one of my weaknesses is getting people to do fun things to internalize some of these concepts can can i just clarify my understanding so where you have signed up for the activity leader Oh, well, you just took your name off. Uh, um, so if you're signed up under 921 on the gray under 921, you're doing the topic from 914? Yes. Okay. So you're going a week behind. So like you'll say, I'm going to do the activity for the stuff that we just learned last week. Yeah. So I was just wondering, so the gray is underneath, so that uh, it's underneath 921. Okay. I got it. Yeah, put your name in the gray. Will we have breakout rooms? Uh, we could if that's what you y'all are in charge. So we do what y'all tell us to do. Breakout rooms seem to help getting more people talking. Right. I don't think we can record the breakout rooms, but we could go into breakout rooms and then come back and then do something as a larger group. But it's also up to you folks. Renee, oh. at risk of being very boring, 
when I took Spanish as a second language, vocabulary lists are helpful. Mm -hmm. And I think, boring as it sounds, if the activity leaders could pick a topic and then put out a list of between 10 and 50 words, including verbs that have something to do with the topic, that might make it easier for some of us who are new to advanced Fündig okay. to have some idea what to talk about. Because always the problem is, how do you come up, how do you have something to talk about if you don't have anything much to start with? Yeah, because I was going to talk today about like families of animals. Like I, I was thinking about the rodent family. Like there's, it's a really big family, right? So you got wolverines and otters and beavers, and they all like have this relationship. And I wanted to sort of, my idea would be, let's talk about that. So then I'd say, like, you gotta go learn the names of every single thing in that family. All the squirrels, all the porcupine, all the mink, the marten, all of that. I want you to know all their names because we're gonna talk about them and, and how they're, what their differences are. Right? And so that's, that's a pretty advanced, topic and we could work our way up to some of those so we can start with maybe topics that might be a little bit more basic and so those of you who are signing up towards the beginning of the semester you might think of some easier things too but then as we're sort of conversing this is like the whole thing I think creating a conversation in an advanced Lingue class is it's going to have to be a somewhat artificial conversation in order to make sure there's opportunities for everybody to talk so you can certainly have some ideas like, we'll have a sign-up sheet, and this is the order everybody has to say, you know, maybe so think of ways to get everybody talking as well. Because if, if the language starts to get really big and complicated, some folks might feel a little intimidated. And so we might also think of, my suggestion just generally is rely on the chat room to say, I'm a little lost here. Can somebody just give me a hint on what we're generally talking about? And that's totally fine to do that. In English, totally fine to do it. Um, but we'll try not to do that in with our language. Like we'll try not to break. Mondays really try not to use English. I know we really have habits of slipping into English, but it's going to be just like we're going to try it, right? And we're going to see how it goes. And we'll also have time to reflect as well. Like, I think also the, I would be completely fine if for the first month that we tried this, we spent a, one hour in Tlingit and then a half an hour talking about it. Right? I'm fine with that. And then we can start building it up and building it up. Mm -hmm. And all the links will be on, this link should are, to this spreadsheet should already be on ClinkitLanguage.com. Also the syllabus, which has your the expectations for the class and everything are there. We'll go over that stuff um, in a little bit more detail. We did go over it on Monday, but I didn't record that class. So, Kadeh! Uh, is it okay to like tell like stories sometimes if you're feeling a little lost or like something that relates to the topic, but through like a story that connects to it or... Yeah, and so like if we're staying in the language, the other thing about it being, an, it's an artificial conversation. Mm -hmm. So it's not like every single thing has to build on everything that's already there. Like, so especially if you feel like there's a kind of a dead time, jump in with something. Okay. And then, but do your best to be, let's try not to let too many things float. Like if someone just says something really pretty deep and emotional. Maybe don't just jump in with some silly story, right? Mm -hmm. But at the same time, I, I think it's all practice. It's all fine. I'll emphasize again, there's no mistakes in language learning. It's all learning. Um, and we can certainly, uh, and we can come up with strategies too. Like we could say, well, there we go. For the first time we do this in Tlingit, We'll go for 10 minutes, stop, take a break. We'll go 10 minutes, stop, take, you know, we could do whatever we want because it's our class. Uh, but as we go further into the semester, we're gonna try to not have, we're gonna try and take the, what do they call it, the little floaties off. We gotta take the float, but we have floaties at the beginning, I'm fine with that. I'm fine with everything. Water wings. <laughs> oh, there we go. Hinkiji.
So I have a, another question and that's to do with this chart. I, I put my name down again for like the, the September 21st and it's like not, wasn't showing up on your screen. So I was wondering, my other name shows up when I did it, you know, like in November, but not the September one. Can you see it now? I see it now. Oh, now you can? Okay. Right. Yeah. It didn't show up until just now. So Weird. Okay. You'll also see how this thing works. But I've got a good, I've, I can blame Achaway Google, right? <laughs> I was organized, but Google couldn't get it to get. I'm just kidding. Google gave us a bunch of money and software. One time Google did give me like a bunch of, they gave me a grant, which meant I had access to all this software. It says we're $20,000. I was like, oh, great. And then they discontinued. <laughs> so, whatever. It was, it was fine. So, could I, um, one week we're going to talk about help people talk about something mm -hmm. and then what about the grammar so it would be here's 20 minutes to do something on conjugation prefixes and then you'll do the rest of the class is that it or yeah yeah i think 20 minutes would be good it's like some sort of thing like hey let's and and it could be like it could be let me show you folks how i'm practicing this stuff and or it could be let's do a fill in the blank thing Right. And so you might it, you might have to have a few things ready, like you might have a few verbs where you're you're just rolling through the objects and you're rolling through the subjects. And, and I've got a bunch of that stuff, too. Right. So it's it's really up to, to you folks what you want to come up with. But I'm just curious to see, because this is also good practice for all you future and current teachers on how to develop um, upper level language stuff. Right. Because we have lots of the lower level stuff, which we still need more of, but we need lots of the intermediate and the advanced stuff as well. So it's hive mind. Isn't that what they call it? Gandits ajikuti yachkukwati. All our brains will be like a beehive. Okay. Gunnar Chish. Ah. I like the idea of a sen of sentence frames. It's something that we use a lot at school to help English language learners. So, you know, that's something consistent, like the frame. And then we have like what Yesh Kagu said is a list of words that we could prepare and then switch them out so that the sentence frame is consistent, but the words being placed in there are different so that we're getting an understanding of the use or the purpose of, you know, where they're placed. And I don't know if, I, I remember last year you had, you're like, oh, this is a great sentence frame because you can just switch this and out. And so I'm wondering if you have like a bank of sentence frames that would be, I don't know, that you're using at the language nest or like that are used in everyday language that if we knew them, we would just increase the number of people who are, are sharing and speaking. Those yeah, I want to come up with some stuff like I don't I don't have a there's a whole bunch of like fill in the blank things from beginning thing which are all in the workbook. Um, but it, it'd be great to have some more things like that. Yeah. And how Sanecha Yilkatangi. Uh, we could go through that and look at things. And so feel free to look at, you know, because I spent the last few years developing a lot of stuff, but a lot of it is just like documenting how it works. And so what what the missing element usually is, is like activity based things. And so use anything that's out there. Um, use anything that I if you're looking for stuff, feel free to and don't feel like you're alone with this stuff as well. Like, if you want to touch base with me throughout the week and sort of say this is what we're thinking do you have any of this stuff and i can send you what i got or send you ideas i'm always on the team my name's on the thing every single week every single day it's also a chance for us to try out some ideas too because if there's 20 of us we probably got a good idea somewhere Uh, one last thing before we go is on our website when I update for today, so 
I'm going to start updating. I haven't done it since the week before the end of last semester. I haven't done anything with the website. Uh, but I'll start doing that again. I'm going to put the most recent draft of the Verb Component Handbook. I think I finished up to the conjugation chapter, uh, which includes uh, a list of verb modes that I I did this right when sort of summer came. I'm going to actually zoom in on here. So this organizes them by what I'm considering calling major modes and then sub modes because like if you can build this, you can now, you can learn how to build this one because it's based off of that. Uh, a good example is the perfective. If you can build a perfective, then you could build a negative, a dependent, a decessive and a negative decessive, right? So this would, for example, this would be uh, I know it. I don't know it. I'm happy that I know it. Uh, I used to know it. I used to not know it, right? And so the idea is like those are all very closely related. And so the, fut the future is like that. Uh, you could have a future decessive, like you could say, we were going to go there, but now we're not, right? So, but uh, put, I'll put this up there. you got a couple weeks to browse it. Um, and then we're going to go through sort of one section at a time with a whole bunch of different activities that are built out of this. And maybe by the end of the semester, I'll have this like handbook ready to go so I can, I can send it to everybody who bought one of those board game things. And then I'll put it in the future board game whatevers. Okay.